Yo, what is up guys, JD Zero, bringing you another me versus Marshadow, the Majestic Marshadow, sorry, because I kind of pronounced it the, I guess, the wrong way when I was looking over the name, but it's Majestic Marshadow, the Majestic Marshadow, so uh, we're gonna go ahead and get our second match in with the Majestic Marshadow and against his ghost team his I guess you would say the ghost team that will be in that situation where hopefully in this particular play I could do a little bit better against his ghost team as to like how I did against his uh, bug team uh, again like I said that Volcarona kinda got me all mixed up when I was trying to deal with his whole team entirely but it's alright with me oh my gosh he has a dual blade that's interesting and he has a semi castle that's another another interesting thing I'm gonna lead off with Kasami. And I feel like leading off with Kasame because I could, you know, go for a dark Z move. I wanted to take out one Pokemon and one shot it and then get the speed boost and should be done. I should be able to take anything out afterwards basically if as playing goes by if if it works it will definitely and he sends out his Mimikyu okay okay send out the Mimikyu now here's the thing because I'm gonna try to break his sub he's gonna go for Feyre Oh my gosh, that's hella madness. That's just madness. Okay. I wasn't expecting that from his Mimikyu. I'm sorry, I was not expecting that from Mimikyu. I should have better planned that. Better freaking plant that, my dudes. Better plan that. That kind of sucks. Uh, I'm gonna try to see if I can get the flinch. Please flinch him. This guy's flinch him, please. If anything, if my Greninja just flinches him. Thank you, Greninja, for the flinch, my bro. Woo! Okay. That's all I needed him to do was flinch this dude and break his disguise. Can I get another flinch, my dude? I get play rough. I flinched him, but I can't get the player rough to work for me. That's that plus two attack, right? He's at plus two attack. That's kind of frustrating to have his mini cute at plus two. Get the little drizzle. Get the little drizzle. Drizzle, drizzle, drizzle. That puts him at plus two, right? Uh, I think so. So, overall, depending on the next set of Pokemon that he has, I'm gonna have to make some switches there and there. I don't know if he's really gonna save his Mimikyu. I mean, he could still, he could wood hammer. My dude could wood hammer. Bruh. The fact that it survived. The fact that me the fact that the fact that Polito survived. That is that is wild. That is pure nonsense wild. Now 
I can't really do anything. I can't do anything. Because I can't bring out Psychic. So. He can Shadow Ball me. It's fine. But there's really nothing I can do against his Gengar. Now, here's another thing. I can Mega Evolve my Blastoids. Go for a Dark Paws. That's gonna basically do a pretty good amount of damage. And there's no rule saying that I cannot use these Mega Blastoids. So, that's another thing. That's the reason why I'm using Mega Blastoids. But he's gonna go for the Z move. Wait, there's a fighting Zenu? Is it a fighting Zenu? There's a fighting Zenu. Does he have, uh, I'm guessing he has, uh, was it Focus Blast? As his Zenu? That's interesting. So he has Focus Blast. That's interesting. I am able to one shot. Cursed Body does not allow me to use any of my uh, dark moves that kind of suck. It really does kind of suck. He's gonna go for the Jellicent. Really shiny Jellicent. Oh my. And again. The only move that's able to use against it will be that dark move, so I will have to switch him out into a Pokemon that will be able to take on that particular mod. I'm gonna have to switch into Slowbro. I'm gonna have to switch into Ball. Goes for the Toxic. Okay. I okay, am gonna go for the Hidden Power Grass, I think it was. He goes for the Acid Armor, so I'm guessing he's going to get some stats boosted, his defense boosts. Uh, it doesn't do as much that it needs to. That kind of sucks. There is some healing. And there is some healing on my side as well. Okay. What can I do to this Jellicent that... There's nothing I could do to this Jellicent. I way... All I could do is probably switch out again. I'm gonna switch out. He goes for another acid armor. That's good because he was gonna probably stall it out anyway, and I'm like, I'm not trying to stall for Schneckums. So, right now, at this moment, I can't do anything. I can't do anything. I can't outspeed. Can I outspeed? I don't think I can outspeed. I could outspeed, but can I get the potential flinch? That's the thing. Yes, my dude! The potential flinch. Yes, thank you. Thank you for the potential flinch, my dude. Okay. So all I need is another Dark Paws. Dark Paws should take it out from this range. And I don't have to worry about any other cursed bodies. Whew, I guess that was the only cursed body that needed to be played on here, my dude. My dude, my dude. Whew.
Oh, the smart play. The smart play that I played onto him, my dude. Um, so here he goes, sending up Stabilize. Stabilize. Ah. Uh, what can I do against this Stabilize? I, I can't really do anything. I could try to burn him. But even then... I can't do anything. The only little powerful move that I have will be uh, using Dark Paws, I guess, because of the Mega Launcher. That's the only thing that's worth doing anything. And I'm due out speed, so can I please get a flinch? He does not get a flinch. Oh my god. He burns me. Is he gonna do a stall? Is he gonna stall me out? Does he have protect? Does he run protect? Because he can't really stall me out like that. Flinch, he got recover. Oh my god. Okay. I need to. I need to get him at health. I'm gonna scoff. I'm gonna scoff and I'm gonna try to see if I could get burnt. He goes for recover. I don't think that doesn't even matter no more because I already got him to the point where he's burnt. Now, here's another thing. Since he's also burnt and I'm also burnt, he does not. If he has Shadow Sneak, Shadow Sneak is not going to do as much damage because I have him burnt. So I'm going to try to pretty much Dark Paws to see if I can flinch him. I do not flinch him. I survive on seven. I'm gonna go for another dark pause. He might be able to if he does have he does have it. If he does have it, that kinda sucks. He doesn't he okay, so I just need to take out this mod before Blastoid just dies off to burn. There is, there is nothing for me to do. He's going to die off the burn no matter what. So. I'm going to go ahead and send in. My. Gentumon. While he sends in Dublade. Now. Knowing this Pokemon. He shouldn't have anything. That will. Hit me in a situation where I'm not gonna survive a move. Is he? He goes for the toxic. Fine, fine. He doesn't have King Shield. He does kill. He could run protect, and he could stall me out with protect. So I'm just gonna go ahead, double the Swords Dance, just in case. Uh, he has Gyro Ball. Gyro Ball does a pretty good amount. I'll admit, Gyro Ball does, does a pretty good amount of damage. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and crunch him because I'm at plus two. And plus two, crunch, shit, take him out in one shot. It does not take him out in one shot. He does get another gyro ball off. Oh my god. And I... That's amazing, my dude. That's amazing. That is amazing. That is amazing. I'm just gonna... That is amazing. That's amazing. So, his last Pokemon... It will be his Sandy Cast. I'm gonna Flamethrower. But I don't know what to expect from the Sandy Cast. Again, I do have Skull. So... It, 
it depends if his sandy cast have anything that will definitely probably possibility to take me out in such a way but I don't know I kind of don't know because I have two moves that can super really effectively take him out three moves if you're counting it he does go for the shadow ball shadow ball should not one shot me it should not one shot me no matter what anybody say that should not one shot me He won. He won. There's no point. He won. GG. When I saw that, GG. GG, my dude. GG. Because either way, even though he's burnt, he still got the plus one boost. He got the special attack boost. The next move that he does is going to one shot no matter what. And he does outspeed my slow bro. So, he's gonna... Wow. Yeah, GG man, yeah. I was not expecting him to have weak policy. And then, the fact of status does give it a boost. That, that also, I wasn't expecting about the status boost. Oh my god, that is a smart play. I'm gonna have to eventually have such a... I'm gonna have to try to see if I can run Sandy Cast because I was literally not expecting that from Sandy Cast. That is amazing. That that right there is amazing. Uh, again, GG. Uh, I was not expecting that. That's two times in a row I lost. Uh, it is a learning experience when you're losing. So I definitely, definitely check the dude out. If you want to go ahead and challenge his gym, Definitely go to the Amino, uh, look up the Amino, uh, what, what was the name of the Amino? It was a... Yeah, it's the Battle Tower, just go ahead and check out the Battle Tower Amino, and generally just see if you can find him in the Ghost Floor, he is the leader of the Ghost Floor. If you want to go and try the, against his Ghost Team and see if you can win, that would be cool. Let me know how it goes. Again, uh, definitely GG to him and whatnot. Uh, comment, share, subscribe, smash the like button, picture, scroll, shades on, and stay awesome, guys. Bye.